Gabungan Parti Sarawak's Chief Whip, Fadila Yusuf, has urged Sarawakians to vote for the coalition tomorrow, saying it has been able to deliver on its promises unlike the opposition. Fadila told FMT that GPS had made several achievements in the state as well as played a role in the recent passing of the constitutional amendments based on the Malaysia Agreement 1963 in the Dewan Rakyat. The Parti Pesaka Bumiputra Bursatu Senior Vice President also said the GPS state government took over many infrastructure projects critical for Sarawak, which were cancelled by the Pakatan Harapan Federal Government using the state's reserves. Our opponents claim we have failed to deliver, but what we have done both in the Dewan Rakyat and in Sarawak for the people proves otherwise. It is clear we have been able to deliver. Unlike the opposition, they make promises in their manifestos, but they cannot deliver. And when they cannot deliver, they say that the manifesto is not a Bible. Urging people to cast their ballots tomorrow, he said, it is your vote that will determine the future of Sarawak. Fadila, who is also the senior federal works minister, said GPS was still continuing the late chief minister Adnan Satim's mission to protect and fight for the state, citing the coalition's slogan, Sarawak First. He said the GPS's endeavour to that end had been successful so far, citing its pursuit of the state's sales tax on petroleum products from Petronas as an example. Sarawak goes to the polls tomorrow, with analysts expecting GPS to secure a comfortable two-thirds majority win.